YouTube, 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 welcome back again, and happy Friday to all, I just want to say that, start off this video, shit, I know, maybe y'all at work, or on your break, or at home, chilling, just thought I popped on the YouTube world with some positivity, and some, uh, some creativity at the same time, but... I also want to give a shout out to all the 23 viewers that, you know, reached out and saw my video yesterday on the track I did with SWV, that whole sample. It's going to be in the description. And you can tune in after this video as well. It's pretty dope. But, um, yeah, I'm going to try to be consistent with this new content format. Just recording my voice with audio. If it's, I feel it's necessary to go along with the video or clip I'm doing. But uh, yeah, I just wanted to pop in and log in with you guys and give you some content I'm doing and what I've been thinking since yesterday. So I got this sample right. This is a very well-known artist that also has been sampled on plenty of times. Um, as we know it, you know. Biggie sampled it as well, but um, so this sample is from Isaac Hayes, Walk On By, but I didn't want to take, you know, the normal beginning of the sample. I was thinking to myself like, hmm, the middle of the song sounds real good to me towards like the main part, so I'm like, okay, let me take that, but let me flip it. But no drum loop, no snares, no hi-hats, no nothing. Just straight up sample and just loop the shit. So I'm like, okay, let me do that. But also, I'm like, okay, let me add some record crackle, some warble through the Koala app and some other effects too. I put some compression as well. Uh, I'll put it right here. Well, it's not loaded up right now, but... The threshold is 5.2, the ratio is 16.9, attack, so on and so forth. I just kept it simple like that. As far as the compression and the EQ is set, we're good with bass. And then the warble, if you don't know about this, it just makes it like a, a tape sound effect, like a cassette player. It gives it that flavor to the track, so I added that in as well. And basically, I'm going by the vibe of this track. More like this song could be like off of an Earl Sweatshirt album. Just like the instrumental in the loop. So I wanted to do it based off that. Just the vibe off of it like that. I like doing shit that's different that nobody really thinks about. So that's what I go for. And I just try to flip it the best way I can. So I'm going to play the track a couple of minutes. Then I'll give y'all my commentary. Once I, you know, dip the fuck up out of here. So enough of me talking without further ado. Let me give you the track. Peace. Whoop. 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 I 
that's it for this track i hope y'all enjoyed it i just kept it short sweet and simple and different just came up with this idea process from yesterday i just thought i'd put it to perspective for y'all to just view on and enjoy once again thank you all my subscribers hit that like button and tune in as always by the way just keep a lookout for my new equipment for the channel I got so many thoughts and ideas processing. I just got to put it on Think Thoughts of Paper and just put it on YouTube for y'all. But um, yeah, just stay on the lookout. This channel going to be good. I'm going to give y'all as much content as I can. Uh, be in tune with all the YouTube shorts that I do during the week. I put out shit on my community page for y'all to tune in. And we'll just go from there. Hope y'all enjoyed this little video. Peace.